It's not something you see every day along I-435, but it happened today. An exotic animal loose near I-435 and K-32 in Kansas City, Kansas. In its break for freedom, freedom, the small kangaroo may have been struck slowing it a bit. Fox News Reagan Porter tonight on how the marsupial got away and how it was finally reunited with family. The Edwardsville Police Department says they received a 911 call about a kangaroo on the side of the highway. When they showed up, officers tell me they were surprised to find exactly that. I never would have thought I'd we'd catch a kangaroo here. This is Star, a baby kangaroo. Eric Smith says she belongs to his nephew. Smith runs Thorny Ridge Exotic Mobile Petting Zoo. Wednesday night, they were at the KCK Public Library. Although Star wasn't part of the show, she came along for the ride. On the way home, Smith says Star made a break for it. He pulled over on the side of the road to, to latch the tailgate. And I guess whenever he got out to latch the tailgate, uh, he, she was hanging on the other side, and at that point, she had to have jumped out a window. Edwardsville police found Star near 435 and K32. Smith says kangaroos can run up to 35 miles per hour. The officers tried to catch it with their hands. I'm sure it was humorous. Um, it was still quick, even though it was injured, so it managed to jump away from them. Um, so they called out an actual animal control officer, and they were able to distract it while she caught it with a net. Animal Control with Bonner Springs believes she crossed three lanes of traffic and may have been hit by a car. There's a little scrape on this side, and then she has a scrape on her eye, and then a little, she has another scrape on her other eye. But. Smith says Star was checked out by a vet by the Kansas City Zoo. Their next stop will also be a local vet in Sedalia. Very blessed. Lieutenant Todd says they believe this was an accident, and they don't plan on issuing any citation or ticket. Reagan Porter, Fox 4, working for you.